good morning guys this is kush and today i'm gonna do a video of ios 6 i just downloaded it on my iphone 4s let me just quickly show you that uh, in generals about you can see the version it's 6.0 i've downloaded it and this is a original by apple i'll show you what's new in it Firstly, I'm going to show you uh, Apple has designed uh, new maps. They are Apple design maps. Um, like you can, uh, when you open them, you really get a beautiful view of the beauty over here. And by tapping over here, you can see some other options. Then this is the location. Then in 3D, let me just quickly see if I can just double tap and show you something in 3d okay yeah let's go to 3d mode and let's see if there's any building that apple has designed in 3d mm, like apple is very specific they have just designed some few important buildings over here but you can do it like press two fingers then down then up then you can get a more better view of it so these are the 3d maps and some of the buildings are also in 3d and if I want to go over here then just drop my pen directions to here from location over here and let's see what does it say and here we are like when we started it's it gives me turn by turn navigation and that's really nice okay and we can have a real time traffic on it then we can have a flowers we can have 3d we can do local search and the main thing we can ask Siri to do it that's really nice thing <clears throat> and then uh, they have updated Siri over here we can ask uh, about the sports then we can tweet then we can post like let me just try update my Facebook status what would you like your message to say see it does okay it does upload Facebook status we can launch applications like um, launch camera I don't see an app named Cumber okay, okay sorry that was my bad launch camera and it launched camera and there are some new features in camera also that I'll show and it doesn't even the C doesn't launch the inbuilt apps it can launch even let me say temple run launch temple run you don't seem to have an app named temp okay come on M P L E R U N. now do it come on yeah see it does now it can launch even any app then you can have i free support in automobiles i don't know what that means but there is something new in it that's for sure then we can do local search from siri also then uh, another thing they have uploaded is siri integration like if i go to settings i scroll down and here i can see facebook and twitter both are integrated then i just have to sign in once over here that's it and then I can post from my Safari or App Store or Game Center notification center like if I scroll down here it is tap to post for Facebook and tap to tweet and uh, that's a really cool feature they have added and the birthdays are automatically synchronized with calendar and and then we can just do shared photos 
let me just go on any pick and when I tap on it we get a really cool pop-up that's for mail message photo stream Twitter Facebook assign to contacts print copy or use as a wallpaper if I go to photo stream then I can send it to any iOS device and we can comment like chat on it as many times we can we want sorry so this is a, these are the photo stream then we can uh, when there's a new feature known as passbook over here like I can get my boarding pass ticket store coupons discount coupons Starbucks anything any coupon over here and then I can use it just scan it and it's done okay then a new feature that I've added is in FaceTime uh, we can do FaceTime over cellular like over here FaceTime it's on okay we can do it over cellular also from now on then the phone itself is improved like if we go to settings then we see a new app for do not disturb okay so this app what it does uh, let me just quickly switch it on you can see a, a moon sign over here for it and when I switch it on I won't get any sound for the unnecessary notifications and if someone calls me then I won't be able to hear the it would be my phone would be on silent but if that person calls me within three minutes then I'll hear it like or I can schedule my do not disturb and then calls I can allow repeated calls like enable when a second call from the same person within three minutes will not be silenced so this is a really nice feature they have done and then they have changed the call feature let me just try and call myself and let's see what does it show I got a, I got a new uh, app where let me just swing up then it says reply with message or remind me later I can remind me later in an hour or or there is one more feature let me just quickly see then rem reply with a message any message I can reply it with then there are some few more uh, they have done in mail they have uploaded the mail like you can see the VIP feature in it you can flag any message then you can upload any video or image very easily then in Safari they have done a change like I can go to offline reading and then I can photo uploading is supported now and we can do landscape also and that too in full screen like if you tap over here then it will come in normal as we did it but if we just tap this small button over here then we'll get a full screen and that's really nice because I love to enjoy the screen hey boy you have a text message okay and then then I can show you the app store app store is also changed the looking wise it it is changed significantly and then the main thing they have done is they have just changed the outlook of the uh, app store okay then in game center also they have changed some some things like few things they have changed it and then they have done some more things in accessibility let me just quickly show you accessibility guided guided ss like if I switch it on some parts of my phone can be used like if I just set a parts one two three four one two three four and then I say guided SS and I say them to not to use the upper part over here and then start it started I can use it all the things but not the upper part of it see you can see that because I have restricted 
anyone to use it like now end it yeah end it just switch it off i don't need it then it's got a voice over also with maps and then some improvements in zoom also and then there are in privacy controls also they have done some significant change and then in uh, the data storage over bluetooth that's also like uh, they have changed in it and let me just quickly show you that the reminders are can be offered in the apps okay then uh, um, you can just customize any vibration like according to you if you want uh, like more vibration or less vibration then you can do it then there is a, a clock app for iPad that I can show you on my phone and then if I go to one second waste my okay 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 sorry that will be new clock if I go to clock then alarms then edit any alarm then I can get all the ringtones even my songs also so they have updated one thing this also and then if I search my contacts then all the fields like Facebook Twitter all the things would be used in searching for contacts then the sound quality uh, for the movie is increased then uh, there are some new keyboards um, over here keyboards like add a new keyboard then you can see um, like Dutch French Germany and then uh, Portuguese then Turkish okay. some new names of have been added and we can do map support by Bluetooth and I guess that's okay that that were the all the features that are there in iPhone 4s by iOS 6 and I really love it I use it daily and I guess uh, you should upload it pretty soon and just tell me if you need or help in it I'll surely help you. Thanks for watching guys.